It's Friday afternoon here at the New York Stock Exchange and U.S. stocks. They're trading sharply lower following a global decline in equities on Greek concerns, as well as new Chinese trading regulations and U.S. inflation and consumer data. The Consumer Price Index showed an increase of 0.2% in March, below expectations of 0.3% in U.S. consumer sentiment, rising more than expected in April. Meanwhile, in the Forex market, the U.S. dollar lacking downward momentum. The Euro dollar 0.23% higher, 107.87. The British pound U.S. dollar pair 0.16% higher, 149.60. This while, the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair 0.05% higher, 119.06 yen. Meanwhile, the Euro-Japanese yen pair that's in focus as it stands above the strong support at 127.45 while remaining on the upside. Long positions above the support at 127.45 are favored with target set, an intraday top of 128.80 and 129.35 in extension. Moving on, precious metals continue to see a positive outlook, gold in focus as its outlook remains positive and is rebounding above a rising trend line. Gold above its 20 period and 50 period moving averages. The relative strength index that's above its neutrality area at 50%. So as long as 1197 is the support, look for further upside to 1209 and even 121250 in extension. And silver 0.01% higher at 1628 a troy ounce. And don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV from the New York Stock Exchange, wishing you a great weekend. I'm James Swinney.